Hi, my name is Aidan Hickey and I'm the Australian CEO for Decision Inc. Welcome to our executive education series on data and analytics. At Decision Inc, we think it is critically important for senior executives to be able to understand this fascinating and valuable topic. We are releasing a series of short videos that cover all aspects of this topic in a level of detail and depth that enables a busy senior executive to be able to grasp the basics and fundamentals. These videos will be released in such a manner that they will be interesting with animations and the topic will be covered by my teams. These topics will include aspects like data governance, definition of a data platform, some examples of an industry, best practice, and finally, where do you start? If you're beginning your journey as an organization to improve your data and analytics capability and means with which to make data-driven decision decisions. So where to start? Consider a house renovation, a topic close to most Australians' hearts, and certainly for myself as I sit here in my garage whilst the renovations are underway in my home. When we renovate a house, there are many aspects that we must consider that have a very close parallels to data and analytics. Firstly, your house is built on foundations. Now, those foundations are critically important to the integrity of the house much the same way as a good data and analytics strategy needs to have the correct foundations. And those foundations can be simple things like making sure that you understand where the data sits, uh, how the data is connected, uh, how the quality of the data is managed and governed inside your organization. If you consider that when you are renovating a house, there is a somewhat cumbersome legal process that you have to undertake to ensure that your house is to code. And again, like a data and analytics strategy, we must make sure that we follow industry best practices when it comes to things like the definition of our data and the way that we govern our data. Particularly in a environment where increasingly there is an expectation for organizations to share their data safely. If you look at the way a house is built and the rules that are applied, those same rules need to be applied to the way that you build a data platform. Uh, we need to understand simple things like whereabouts does the data reside? Is the data of a good quality? Who owns the data? And how do we connect that data up? The house needs to be secure. One of the fundamental aspects of a home is a roof. Without that, the house is not safe and it is not waterproof. And with a data analytics capability inside your organization, it must be safe and secure. There must be the appropriate data security policies to ensure that your data is kept away from prying eyes and those that are allowed to use the data can use the data safely and confidently, knowing that the data is of a quality and is secure. Your house lives within a neighborhood and is connected to various amenities and services, whether that is water, whether that is power, or certainly in my household, whether that is broadband and the internet. And much the same with the data platform and data capability. Often you need to have those connections externally, whether or not that is to understand what is happening within your environment and collecting that data, such as a retailer and understanding where do shoppers go and why do shoppers behave the way they do, or simply being able to exchange that information across your extended organization. So there are many parallels to a home renovation and to a house. And the final one is the aspect of the house. Do you look at it from your north or from the south facing? And do you realize the house looks completely different? And that is exactly the same with data and with analytics. Analytics is the window into your data. And depending upon where you look at it and how you look at it will determine how you make decisions with that data. If you find yourself struggling a little bit through this process of education, 
Draw back to this analogy. Think about your house. Think about the aspects that make your house the way it is today and the comparatives that you will see drawn out through this education. We hope that you enjoy it and we hope that this gives you a thirst for the knowledge that you need to be successful with data analytics inside your organization and within your personal life. Thank you and we'll speak soon.